Yeah, it's good to be back in the Eastern Cape. We were in Umtata 10 days ago. We find ourselves a little bit just further to the southwest down in the Windy City, the friendly city, the city of Nelson Mandela, as we are at the Madiba Stadium tonight for the Nelson Mandela Metropolitan University against the Walter Sisulu University, both of those big names in uh, stalwarts. <laughs> Sagantita, second time in a row, space at the back post! No contact made by Jackson. Oh, good play, enterprise from NNMU early on, and Graham Harrison wants to break their duck as far as goals are concerned. Well, nicely picked up here by the Nelson Mandela Metropolitan University, though. Class, it's a good ball! Just wide from Sagantita. Oh, that was so close to the opener. A bit of a mistake in defence here by WSU and an opportunity for Chuma. Little back heel, probably not the right idea from Sasha Jackson. And that's gone in the back of the net. I don't think it'll count. The assistant referee flagging Mr. Timbi and Korsi Mungai. So Tinkita looking forward. It's a really good opportunity for WSU and against the run of play. It is a goal. I think it's Infoketo who might have grabbed another. His third goal of the championship. Infoketo from the right hand side. Good play from WSU. They had the flow. Once again, Nelson Mandela Metropolitan University caught at the back. Well, he did caught at the back. Look at that beautiful back heel. And Infoketo does the easiest of things, just pushing the ball between the space. Headed away by Lonwabo Balfour. Oh, and a little bit of a miscue here from Klaas. Saved by Boyson. Well, they're the, the masters of their own demise here. Nelson Mandela Metropolitan University. You can't give Walter Sisulu University this much space because this might happen. It might have been a bit lower as well. It's going to be a corner. And another great opportunity from Fuketo. Well, this is one man that really means business. <laughs> Sagantita's done well here. It's quite a big player and he holds off opponents very nicely indeed. There's a chance for Jackson, perhaps the best of the match for NNMU. Well, that has to go down as uh, the best chance for on the you know for NMMU in this uh, half. No doubt that the Port Elizabeth side will want to strike back as soon as possible. In New Kenya. Just about enough of a stretch from one of the Balfour brothers. Well, WSU continuing the, the attack. Rudy Balfour looking adventurous too from the centre-back position. The number 16 is going to have to scurry back now because the ball is with the goal scorer. Kusel and Fiketo. Scotch. Should be a tap in here. No! The miss from Losse. Again, and I mean you absolutely in tatters at the back. And any one of two WSU players could have attacked that in and a little bit of composure from Odwe Lose, who wasn't under too much pressure, could have had a second goal. <laughs> McLavi now finds Mapuma! Goal! Well, Mapuma creates it. And Nelson Mandela Metropolitan University grabbed their first goal of competition 61 minutes into this sixth match and the fireworks go off around the stadium with the great uh, understanding I'm sure wonderful work done here delightful ball well this is the stage of the game when both teams need to concentrate and uh, just keep things really tight and with the kind of defending that uh, well here's a chance Juma Mapuma keeper makes a save a great save too really can't believe it that was a win all over the place. But an absolutely glorious chance here. Mapuma puts in a really inviting ball. And uh, wow. I mean, look at that second touch, actually. So the first home match of the campaign brings some success. It could have been a victory if it hadn't been for a brave save by Fuhile Maniala. And Paqueto scored early. And on the hour market is Toby, who equalized for NNMU, their first goal of the campaign.